Hello to you all dear guys. I hope you're doing very well. Today we are here to learn a wire ring that is a set for these beautiful earrings that we had a tutorial in previous videos. All you need is 0.8 wire for the main structure, 0.5 or 0.4 wire for the weaving parts, a mandrel to wrap the structure and the wire all around it, and also a pearl. Of course, it should be a little smaller than the previous one and be suitable for our ring. And let's see what is the size. It's about five millimeters. And also your wire cutter and round nose pliers. So let's start by drawing the main structure and let's see what would be the shape and the overall look of the wire that we are going to cut. First of all, we need to size the ring size that we are going to make this ring for and you could help a yarn and just wrap it all around your finger and put it on a paper with your pen or pencil. Just determine the length of your ring size. And here we are going to have a wire like this. And the pearl would be here. So pick up your 0.8 wire Cut it out about twice of the size that you had determined first. Let's see what is it. It's about six centimeters and twice of that it would be 12 centimeters and a little bigger about 0.5 centimeters would be okay. So 12 and a half is the size that I need to cut the wire for the main structure. Now, somewhere in the middle of this main structure, just put your round nose pliers and bend it, just like this. This is the part that your pearl would be in, so it should be appropriate for the size of your pearl, and it would be a little bigger, so let's Curve it a little with a bigger part of your round nose pliers so that when we put the pearl in, it would be a little loose and there would be a space for the weaving parts. Now, we need to make these two tails a little straight with your hand and your fingers just pull these two parts and this is the time that we are going to attach the wire into this main structure. Just push the end a little and make the overall structure of this part so that it would be almost ready to be wrapped all around your mandrel. Okay, just with your index finger and your thumb. Correct the shape and pick up your 0.4 or 0.5 wire and insert your pearl in and put it inside and at the middle of the U shape of your structure. And now with your round loose pliers, just bend it and insert it back and pull it. Then repeat it at least for two or three times to fasten this part 
this is a very simple and minimal wire weaving and there is no need to be professional at it or a very hard work it's so simple and you could make it just with a little practicing and also don't forget to push the end of the wire onto the work so there wouldn't be any sharp edges left so push it onto your main structure when you have done making this part and your first coiling part this is the time to cut the other side and repeat this again for that part two so with your round nose pliers make a little u and pull it so that it would be totally and completely be wrapped all around the main structure and again do that the same as we did just for the other side just we had three little loops here and we would repeat this for three times too till now we have a u-shaped structure with a pearl at the end that is going to be in front of your finger and we are going to push this a little so that there would be a tear shape here and then attach the remaining parts by bending them a little and like this we would have a structure here we attach these two parts as we don't have a welding or any other mechanism and techniques to attach these two parts so again we use our thinner wire and this would be as simple as the weaving parts that we have to attach the pier on the main structure and just we wrap the wire all around these two strands and just the important tip is that you should be careful so that every round would be totally attached to those main strands and you could push them so that they would be attached to each other and we do that at least for three or four times and then we cut the wire at the side that is above I mean if this would be the ring cut the wire so that the sharp edge would be on the above and not inside though we push the remaining part onto the main structure so there wouldn't be any sharp edges but we do that and then at the other side we cut the wire out push them again and again wrap it just beside the other wrapping parts when you have done wrapping these parts push it a little into that side and now we had fixed this part and we are ready to wrap it all around our mandrel at the ring size that we had determined on our mandrel or any other cylindrical shape like pen or pencil okay just wrap it all around and this is the important part 
we should throw these two strands into this part and just fix them at this part. So with your round nose pliers, make them round and insert them into this part and at the end push them to be attached to each other and also to close this part So that it would be like little loops here. And if needed, again, put it on your mantle. to correct the shape and with the plastic part of your tool just hammer it a little so that the shape would be fixed and now some correction at this part with your round nose pliers would help to achieve a better shape. And now, this is your beautiful wire ring that is now a set to your wire earring that you had learned in previous tutorials. I hope you had enjoyed this tutorial and you would make one for yourself or the one that you love or for selling this beautiful wire jewelries. Take care and bye-bye.